Good morning, guys. Good evening, actually. Today, I am playing some Vanilla Rust with Spoon Kid, and we're doing a 1v1 wipe. Uh, this is Spoon Kid's base. Now, you might be wondering, well, this is Spoon Kid's base. Where's your base? We've been playing since wipe. I had a bad wipe. Very bad start. Uh, I had to buy a new keyboard today. I'm not kidding. So, um, I'm restarting from fresh. He raided me. If you want to see his POV, definitely go check out his video. Uh, I'll make sure to link it in the description when it's out. But I'm going to get start and I'm going to get my revenge because he raided me. I was in a two by one with two Iokas and a sword and he raided me and rubbed it in my face. Also, my sound wasn't working. That's how badly like my computer was messed up when I hit my keyboard. My just sound turned off. So with a new keyboard and much higher spirits, I start my wipe off here at this river. I need to get a base down and run oil. That is what I have to do. He's getting tired, so he's actually logging out soon. Hey, one arrow, come up. Mace, come up. That means I've got like 12 hours to get a beginning. I should add this is a solo server, which kind of makes this challenge a bit easier and a little bit more fun for the both of us. Yeah, keep that in mind, but he's got every VP in the game. I don't have a single VP, so we might have to get him to craft us some higher tier stuff, but for now, we're just gonna start, and I'm gonna do one of two things. Either I'm gonna try and hit an early oil or just build a base. I think I'm just gonna build a base. I feel like that's a smarter and a better idea, and then as soon as I build the base, we could get oil, so... That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna start off by building. Our goal is to build in the same-ish area. So obviously you guys just saw his base. So I'll build somewhere around there so that it's kind of even and we could get this wipe started off good. I, I played for, I think, five five or six hours and it was, it was really difficult. I, I don't know what it was. It was rough. The, the wipe started out so great. I know I'm talking about it and you guys aren't going to see it from my point of view, but the wipe started off great and it was insane. Like I had key cards, I had everything. And the admin, I'm not kidding, accidentally re-wiped the server and it like ruined the wipe. And then from there, I just couldn't get any luck and Spoon got some good luck. So he, uh, he got that leg up on me, but it's all right. Got eight scrap from this guy. We're I'm, I'm actually stoked. I just had Chipotle. I'm feeling beyond fantastic and i mean it i'm feeling beyond great so i think this what this time around it's gonna go good honestly i'm really feeling it so I'm, I'm, I'm stoked this is this is actually hype actually hype but let's build a base let's get everything sorted and we'll uh we'll get right into it all right my wife's begun for the second time wife's begun i'm gonna get revenge oh i believe man i think you know you're you just had a, a bad toss up you're a very you're a bad toss player up. you're a fantastic rust player i believe in you and i think Thanks, uh, you have a great shot but it's but... still not gonna happen really i am the best okay you hear this guy oh my lord i commend you for trying and i think you'll get very far hey, you'll see what's coming you gotta go to bed soon. You're tired, huh? I'm ditching the trap day. I will sit inside all day tomorrow. I'll ditch the fucking trap day too. You think I won't? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I'm a demon, bro. I'm a demon. I'm killing it right now. Just got a bow. So hyped. Is that you? Arctic suit? Maybe. You look like a punk ass bitch. I can smell you from here, you onion smelling motherfucker. Sorry. Yeah. I'm kidding. Don't shoot me. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'll leave his stuff. That wasn't me. Oh, that was you. Now take his stuff. Oh, he's loaded. You want his stuff? I'll leave it on him. Uh, I'm, I'm taking stuff. I left it. All right. You're not going to believe it. What? I got a fucking green card finally. Dude. Eight hours Ashy. later, I got a green card out of first this gas green, station. Baby's first green card. Baby's first green card out of gas station. Eight hours later. I'll give you stuff. I'll give you stuff. Please. 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 Don't kill me. I'll give you stuff. Let me see your name. Yeah. What the fuck? Oh my. Stupid thing would go off. Already off to a good start. On here. Ah! Ah!
Now, I go on my quest to get cards. This is an important quest, and I can't afford to die on this one. So I'm really hoping it works out, but actually works out. You know what I'm saying? Where could I go to get a blue? Could go to sewer branch and then power plant. I think that's what I'll do. Can I be in a video? We'll, we'll see, you, maybe. I'll give you a splitter if I can be in a video. Industrial splitter. Depends. It depends what my editor leaves in. I gotta go get cards though. I'm in. A, I'm in a doing a race. I'm doing a race. Oh. Whoa. Oh. This poor guy had a lot of loot. Once I get cards, hopefully Smoil comes up. We head over to Smoil and run it. And once I get a good foothold with some weapons, stuff like that, we'll be good. You know what I mean? So it looks like sewer branch has been done. I guess we'll just slide over to outpost and get some scrap. Oh, got a guy on a horse over here. Okay. I mean, I'm getting some use out of this SAR. What gun did he have? Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Beautiful stuff. Beautiful stuff. I'm going to go depot this like right now. I'm literally getting out of here. That's a come up and a half, dude. I lost my good horse, but it's fine. Meds are wonderful. Nice thing to have. I haven't had meds like all day. No ammo though. Got a blue card. We could just go back to power plant, which I'd almost kind of prefer because I don't really have the ammo for Arctic that much. I have 12 bullets extra and I don't have ammo like that in base either. Plus, it just kind of makes a lot of noise doing Arctic research base. So I think just keeping it simple. I also don't really know how to run Arctics that well. So I just go to power plant. And it's it's easy. It's not too far away with this trusty horse. This horse is goaded. We are in the power plant. I cannot believe it. Monumentous moment. I'm getting key cards after eight hours of a grueling wipe. Super stoked for this. I'm not going to lie. I know you guys obviously don't get to, did get to see any of the bad stuff, but I definitely recommend you check out Spoon's POV because he actually had an insane wipe day today. He killed it for sure on his end. It's been a long time since I played wipe. I'm going to be honest. I'm not a big white player, as you guys know, but it's good to do every once in a while. And you know what? Finally, as I pick up this red card, things are turning around. So I'm stoked. We're just going to recycle all this stuff and uh, get back to base with it. And uh, we'll head out to oil as soon as it's up. I'm a little worried about my ammo deal, but I think we'll be okay. Someone's running this. Okay. For free? Let's get out of here. All right, we made it home. Let's go. I'm so hyped. Oh, we got cards. We got it all. All right, let's just wait for oil to come up and we'll head out to it. Guys, it's up. I don't think anyone's on it. I was looking at the cameras. So this is my chance for finally a big come up, I hope. Going to Smoil. Screw large. Made it to oil. Nice, man. Hi. I got killed outside the raid. Did you lose the raid? No, I just got camped leaving with everything. <laughs> I'm falling apart, man. I should just go to bed. I think you should. I think you should leave me to my own devices. Look, how does this sound for a deal? You go to bed, I farm like a lot tonight, and then by tomorrow, I'm gonna have the sulfur cooked. I'm gonna have you craft me a rocket and an explosive, and we uh, duke it out. Duke it out, big the, time? The tiebreaker or 
tie maker the final the penultimate i don't think that's the right word but you know what i'm saying how's that sound yeah down for that i mean unless you got any other ideas um not particularly i think i'm just gonna i'm gonna accept the l on the raid and just just throw on the towel tonight Fair enough. You really gonna farm up that much? You think you could stay up that long? 20 rockets? Give me like three oils. 20 rockets? No problem. 20, what, how, do you know how much rockets 20 rockets is in sulfur? Per chance? 28,000, right? 28,000 sulfur? Easy. If you get offline, holy shit. I didn't think about that. Yeah, that would kind of throw a wrench in things. That would throw a fat wrench in everything. I can't quite possibly think of a worse outcome. Well, you know what? I'll make sure you don't get offline. Do you know where BB Boca lives? Or B Boca, do you know where he lives? Yeah, no clue. I got farted on big time at that raid. Damn, he shit on you that bad. You're trying to find his base. Yeah. Wow. 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 That's like what I would do after I lose to you and UKN. Holy moly, poor guy. He took advantage of a sleepy old man. I really don't think you're gonna farm 30k sulfur and prepare it. The prepare might be questionable. I'll try and do as much as I can tonight. I mean, if I could get a compound up, yeah, no problem. I'm a little worried about charcoal, but yeah, sulfur easy. Yeah, the charcoal is going to be rough. Yeah, it'll be all right. I'm already calling in heavies on oil. I'm hyped. I'm in my zone. It took me fucking like so long to get here. Ooh, explo ammo. That'll come in handy. Oh, I'm getting countered. That was a risky peek, but a good one. Good health, SAR is nice. Things are finally going according to plan. It only took, like, forever. But good things are happening here. That's why you always leave the bottom scientist, by the way, because it shoots and it alerts you if someone's someone else is countering. It's actually a good strategy. I want to loot the guy I killed on the boat, but oh my god. I'm hoping I can pull an AK off of this oil. All right, I think we're all set. Gonna have to run a couple oils. Oh, oh, Bolt GL, great scientist. We need more of these scientists, you know? Beautiful stuff. I have a feeling the guy that countered me is gonna come back and break my boat uh, and try and harpoon me to death. And I've never used the harpoons in this game. So that's not good. Guess we'll see. Pretty solid oil so far though. I'm definitely pretty happy with this one, I must say. I was saying it a lot earlier, but all I need is this one oil. If I get, a, if I can get off with this oil and all this loot, we are gonna be cheesing for infinity trust. So I need to farm 20 rockets in order to raid Spoon tomorrow. And I don't have BPs, but I'm gonna have him craft some BPs or uh, some rockets for me tomorrow if I can't get them, but hopefully I'll be able to take a heli tonight. But we have a long night of grinding ahead of us, boys. I'm kind of stoked for it, though, a little bit. I mean, it feels good once I'm, once you're, like, on your feet. And every time you die, you're not, like, reset to zero. Feels good. I mean, I'm, I shouldn't speak yet because I'm not there yet. If I die right now, we're down bad. But I got a good feeling about this run, honestly. I'm going to try and fill up my boat a little bit. I'm just worried about getting grubbed. I think we're okay. Oh, God. Heck, could have gone worse. Maybe. Maybe if we get lucky, we could hit a cheeky large oil. I could just go depot and hit large immediately. That'd be a massive come up, like huge. But I guess I'm not expecting that. All right, what'd we get? Oh, whoa. Why can't every oil be like that? Oh, mama mia. Okay, let's see. Problem is I kind of need like all this stuff, but this... 
should be good, I think. I think we'll get out of here. LR, two MP5s, garage door. That is a good oil. I'm very satisfied with that. Very, very satisfied with that. I'll go check for the body of the guy I killed out here, but I'm pretty sure it got looted. Oh, wait, maybe not. Okay, hold on. Come on. Eh. I'll take an extra SAR, why not? Never hurts. Let's go uh, get all these goodies back to base. Heli's out by military base. So I'm gonna see if I could take it with my newly found wealth of the LR and this bolt, which is unbelievably hype. Like, I'm stoked about it. I hope Heli doesn't get taken by someone else. That is my ticket to getting rockets quickly, but it's pretty far away. I'm hoping it'll roam down towards power plant and especially towards this gas station. That'd be super great for us. But I just have to pray that someone else doesn't take it in the meantime. So it's a little bit tough, but should be all right. I don't think we're gonna get Heli. Oh, well, Heli got taken. Well, I think we'll just go to large for now and just continue stacking dough, you feel me? Oh my god. What the? That guy is not skilled. Oh my god, dude. What the? Let me just go to oil, bruh. I want to deal with this. Okay, now I gotta watch out for door camper. That guy was literally door camping me for like a while. I can't believe he messed that up. <laughs> okay, very interesting. Oh shoot, did I leave anything in the front of the boat? Oh, I hope I didn't. I might have, honestly. Nope. Eh, well, I guess we'll never know. I don't know if I did. All right, here's our large. The long awaited and deserved come up. Finally. All right, so once again, I'm gonna leave this guy alive. So that way, if someone comes and counters and they like scuba up or something, you know, I know they're coming. Make sense? What a jump. I think oil's a better call than heli anyways for now, because either way, when I log on tomorrow, I know I'm gonna have rocket BP one way or the other. So if anything, probably the smarter bet would be to do Bradley and get a bunch of MLRS. But for now, let's just get our feet straight, our bearings straight, whatever, and uh, run some oils. It ain't much, but it's honest work. Oops. Dang, I'm four diesel from one large. I don't think there's an excavator on this map. Yeah, no excavator in the desert. We could just go run sulfur quarry if it's not controlled. I don't know if it's controlled or not. This is my last card swipe. Hopefully it's worth it. Custom. Nice. Hazmat suit. We take those. AK. Ah, MLRS is all right. The more MLRS we have, the better. Ooh, wait, cargo. I think cargo literally just spawned. I feel like we should just go to cargo instead. I have a little bit of time. What if I try and really quickly kill these heavies, loot them, and go to cargo? I probably have a couple minutes to kill these guys. So let's do it. Screw it. But we got to be quick, though. Gotta be quick. Oh, 
Dude, oil is doing me so nicely today. That's like a 1% chance to get that. I gotta hurry up though. All right, we got one more scientist to loot and we're going. Oh, two more. Oh my God, double AK from oil. No way. What are the odds of that? Okay, last scientist. A ton of HEs, like a literal ton. All right, let's just get going. I mean, the crate could possibly be good, but the allure of three crates is too good to pass up. I'm sorry. There's a mini going for it, but he's kind of landing a bit funny. It kind of looks like he does not know what he's doing. I'll be honest, I don't really have much to lose because either way after this, I need to go farm a card or cards again. So you know what? I'm just going to send the counter and hope it works out. I really, really, really hope this one works out. And I think it will. I think we'll be good. I just need to play it smart and play it right. He has a mini too. I, I think it's worth the risk. Honestly, I really think it's worth the risk. I have bull, two AKs, bunch of meds. We're, we're good. I shouldn't worry. He has a SAR too. Yeah, we're good. We're good. Okay. Ah, every time from that spot, dude, I always die to that exact peak every time and i still fall for it every time it's all right it is not the end of the world although that is rather tragic like i said earlier it'll be okay we have backups for this exact reason but that does leave us i could try and just counter again although this time it's risky because now he's got two ak's i didn't think he heard me come up i'll be honest should have ran the other way man i should just run the other way every time instead but it's all right that is harsh. Let's just go for it, dude. Screw it. I don't have much more to lose. We got to wait till Smoil's up anyways again. And oils take forever to come up on this server. So I got to apologize for that. I mean, I shouldn't have lost it like that. Not like that. I don't know. It's something about that right side hallway. I always die there. Like hands down. It's like a weird angle, I think, for me pushing that. It's a very odd angle. It's like off or something. And somehow like they can kind of see me before I could see them at all. So I just always end up getting blasted every time, man. Oh, that is painful. That is painful. I mean, it's a big loss, but we're going to get it back. I need to go for some major plays tonight. I could play all kind of conservatively and like, ooh. But I got to hit some major plays tonight if I want to raid Spoon by like tomorrow, which is in like 12 hours. Like I've got 12 hours to get 20 rockets and at least gear. You know what I'm saying? Which is enough time. I've done it before, but we just need to make sure everything lines up properly. But we're going to go back to this cargo and uh, get on it. That's so unfortunate that I didn't get on it first, man. Well played to that guy. Lucky he had a mini. All right, I'm going for the same play again, except I'm praying that this one works out this time, that I don't mess it up. Otherwise, back to card farming for Old Blazed. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Well, that didn't go much better than the first time. I'll go get cards and, uh, I guess farm sulfur in the meantime while we wait for Old Oil to come up. Where did I get the other... LR. Or no, I didn't bring an LR to oil. I brought a SAR. That's right. Okay. Well, uh, yeah, let's go to power plant, get another red card and, uh, get back in business, baby. Yes, sir. Not really. It's a bit rough on the senses, but I think it'll be all right. I've taken much worse losses. So yeah, it's fine. All right. Smalls back up. Got the red card for power plant. And a one swipe blue card, which is a bit tough, but we need to win this moil and I need to be smart this time. And we might go to large afterwards after depoting and be smart and not lose it. You know what I'm saying? Back to smoil. We're destined and uh, back to farming. So we'll see. Hopefully something interesting happens. Actually, hopefully nothing interesting happens. I hope that nothing happens on this smoil and I just get seven AKs and 100 C4 and we're good. All right. I'm on oil and there's a guy looking at me. I'm going to try and get him to push. Looks like he's wearing a hazmat suit. Probably a tier two guy. He's really just hanging back there. I'm worried he's got a bolt or something, but don't think he does. Oh, he might be waiting for me to call it. I don't want him to shoot me.
I think he's scubaing up because I don't see him on his boat anymore. It's the same guy as last time. Dude, this guy is dedicated, bruh. Same exact guy, too. With harpoon and everything, bro. You guys are seeing what I've been dealing with all day. Dude, I, you never see people like this dedicated to the harpoon oil counter strat. Like, I haven't seen people this dedicated in a very long time. Maybe on like an ultra... Maybe on like an ultra high pop server, but I mean, wow. That is like actually impressive dedication. He's been at it for like four hours now, literally, and I'm not exaggerating. He's been doing the harpoon strategy for four hours. I feel like it'd be quicker to just buy cards at that point. Now I gotta go dive down to get his weapon too, but I need that SAR kinda a little bit down bad. I will say a good thing that's happening is the loot drops on this server seem to be wonderful. I notice on some servers I get more explosives and no guns or something like that, but on this server I'm just getting like a bit of everything. It's actually great, so I, I do got to give it that. I mean, I ain't hating. It's a pretty gruesome wipe, but we're working on it. We're working on it. Let's go dive down and get this guy's gun before he has time to come back and grub us. And uh, and then I'll come back and call in the scientists, I suppose. There it is. Free good health SAR. I will happily accept that. Hopefully we get a good elite crate here. Okay. Uh-huh. That's good. Some different scuba rat. Oh my god. Some random guy, dude. It is so, such a good thing that I leave the bottom scientist alive on this server. Oh man. If I didn't, I'd be dead like 700 times over by now. Not even kidding. I'd say that's why I very rarely play group capped servers. Nice, another MP5. That's why I very rarely play the group capped servers, because. And any Rust players here, tell me if I'm wrong, but I feel like I find way more grubbing and just kind of grub strats on like solo duo trio servers, or in this case, the solo server. You know what I mean? Like there's another guy scooping up again. You know, it's like crazy. I think he's chopping my boat. You know what I mean? Like, I feel like there's more grubbing going on for so It's weird, like you'd think somewhere he's trying to harpoon the scientist are you kidding me you get out of here with that i just think you'd think it'd be less common on a server where you're not fighting zergs like rubbing against zergs totally makes sense but when you're just ratting like solo players it's confusing like i i feel like it's the purpose of the solo duo trios and in this case the solo only is like so you don't have to rat so you can fight and you know that they're all dead or, or what have you you know what i mean I don't know. It's just a weird observation I've noticed throughout my time playing group cap servers. And it's something, it's, it's a big reason why I avoid them, but I'm, I'm enjoying it because I kind of know the anti-rat strats a little bit, but unfortunately uh, for these guys, they're probably a little bit upset that I've been leaving that bottom scientist alive. <laughs> Although uh, that guy's paid dividends. So shout out to the bottom scientist. I just gotta make sure they don't chop up my boat, but I'll be okay because I have this spear gun mabob, but honestly, I, I don't know how to use it. Literally, I've never shot one of these. Like, I, I don't, never gotten in an underwater fight, like none of that. He's back again. Please don't kill my scientist. If I could throw him meds, I would. Poor guy. I think I just killed him again. Stay away from my oil, please. Yep, I got him. Crate should be up soon, so we'll uh, we'll get out of here. All right, what are we gonna get? Come on, give us something good. Holy moly! I mean, I cannot complain there. Wow, that's great. 
I'm going to chuck out that. Definitely want the M39. Armor door. Take these windows. Throw the rest out. Let's get out of here. Wow, that's great. Another C4. We have two C4 already, which means actually tomorrow we're just going to need eight rockets if we want to raid Spoon, which is actually very achievable. But I have a feeling he's going to upgrade quite a bit tomorrow. So I guess we'll see. Just going to get out of here. Pretty solid. Uh, now... Like Groundhog Day. Let's go hit up Large Oil. See, well, let me check my phone and see if someone's running it on the cams. It's a pretty cool, uh, cool thing. Yep, we're good. Large Oil is still clear. So we'll go depot all this, hit up Large Oil, and I will not make the same mistake as last time, I promise, okay? Or will I? Pretty sure I just saw a geared guy at my base. Pretty sure that guy was geared. I wonder if I'm gonna get raided. By that guy that was door camping me earlier or something. I definitely think I'm getting camped. Very weird. Super weird. Let me just put this armored door on. It's a good start. Um, I need to make two of those. I also need to go get my boat. My boat is loaded. I would much rather not lose the boat. That would be a major loss. Let me go get my boat. Super, super peculiar. I swear to God, I saw a guy with a coffee can just chilling right up here. Like, chilling. I mean, hard chilling. Definitely scheming on me to come back home. I got a bad feeling. I mean, I'm gonna still be on for at least another three hours. So I'll have time to upgrade the base. But unfortunately, sulfur wise, didn't make it too far today. That's all right. 2C4 is still solid though. It's a great start it's more about the guns and stuff if i can just get oh uh, oh dude i thought my boat got stolen i was like oh no if i could just get the guns ammo and then get like you know a surplus of key cards i'll be very excited with that that'd be great if i could just get a surplus of key cards for tomorrow for just some more oil we'll be chilling and then tomorrow all i need is a jackhammer and a mini and we'll be we'll be cruising We'll be cruising. I just gotta be very careful about getting camped. Let's do some upgrading. I think it's about time we should. All right. I feel much safer now. And also much poorer on metal. I feel like it's about time we upgrade to a tier two as well. Although, I don't know if it's in the budget. <laughs> 500 metal. Yikes. That's steep, huh? Pretty steep. Let's take this red card and head to oil rig, shall we? I think this will this will go well. Got a good feeling about this one. And I swear, no more mistakes. Like Gus Fring says, never make the same mistake twice. All right, find myself here again. Two lovely large oil. Try our luck with the elites again. Something good. Give us some more AKs. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Turret useful and interesting all right we'll just call this little guy in quickly i think we have enough ammo and meds for it i'm pretty sure but you know what maybe don't quote me on that Three bullets left, bruh. Three. We better make this count. Okay. I think the Rust Gods gave us a gift last time with the double AK drop. And I might have thrown it away because this is not looking too hot. Too hot. <clears throat> not hot in the slightest, actually. Uh... No ammo, no firearm, just uh, kind of goofy loot. But you know what? I kind of deserve it. In fact, I definitely deserve it for throwing away the greatest large oil in rust, dude. I deserve it. I'm sorry, I, but I do. I hate to say it. It hurts me. Trust me, it hurts. I shouldn't have done it. It was worth the risk at the time, but it was definitely not worth the risk. I haven't had like 10 HEs as well, dude. Oh, man. All right. Okay. Yeah, we'll take that. I'll take that. 
Why not? Pretty solid stuff. Still got my AK back after that tragic mistake. We'll hit the recovery. Beautiful stuff. You love to see it? Let's hop down, get in the boat, and get home. We're back. Good haul from oil. Don't want to count the spoils before, you know, inside. But I think the plan is from here, more or less the same. I'm going to farm some cards. Oil will come up. We do it again. It's pretty late at night, so we could take advantage of the uh, opportunity to actually get cards. I'd say that's the hardest part of today is getting cards now that we have guns tomorrow when there's like more people on and stuff it'll be fine but yeah without guns getting cards was very very difficult today i don't know i mean i'll do a little loot montage of what we get from the other oils but we're not rated either which is nice i don't know if you guys want to see me run oil for the umpteenth time well maybe some of you do some of you guys are oil fiends man i respect it i respect the oil grind it's a good grind to get on out of all the things in the world to grind oil rig's pretty good pretty effective beautiful we're all double armored doored up base is feeling pretty safe cozy and nice which is always a great feeling i'm just gonna like i said follow along with the plan we'll go get some cards We'll do it all over again. Let's get it. I actually, I think the next step is going to be actually, hold on. Let's make this tier two because now I have enough to make a tier two for sure. I'm thinking I could get a heli and that would make things like 10 times as fast. Although it's a bit risky, I definitely wouldn't want to lose it. I should definitely have enough to recycle for a heli here and then some too for sure. I definitely have enough for a heli on me. Definitely have enough. So, I might just go get a heli. I really, really, really feel like that's a good call. Go get the heli, be able to fly around, get cards super quick, get everything super quick. We'll be chilling. It'll be a good day. So, let's just do that. Let me go get this heli. We'll be good. We'll be good, dude. Things are turning around. Things are turning up good, too, man. I'm pretty stoked about it. I shouldn't jinx it, I know, but I'm stoked. I just want to do some more base upgrades, I think, for sure. I still feel like this base is a little bit weak. We'll go get a heli, see if I have enough to spare for a jackhammer, and then get this crude crook, crude cooked. From there, we're chilling, boys. That's the plan. It's going to be a good plan. It's got a thoroughbred with high-quality horse shoes. That's, like, nearly as good as a heli. I guess the only thing is it can't take me to oil, but you know what? I might just use this guy instead. Honestly, look how fast it is. It's insane. This will save me some scrap for now. Not that I really need it. I guess I kind of do. I don't have any like BPs, so we'll just save the scrap. I was just going to take the horse to outpost and buy the heli, but that seems like a suitable option. Still need to solve the low grade problem, but fixable, fixable. All right, let's go get cards. Beautiful. I'll check back in with you guys when something notable happens. Although I really just think tonight's just going to be a lot of farming, which is what I expected and definitely obviously what I anticipated. But I feel like wipe day is just kind of like who can farm the most. I just that's how it is for me. It's like once I get tier two on wipe day, I don't know what to do. I feel lost, I feel directionless. But since we have a rivalry with my neighbor, Spoon Kid, and there's a goal, you know what I'm saying? So I'd love to get the sulfur tonight too. 28,000 sulfur, I could get that pretty quickly. I'd love to get that by tonight if I could. Oh, this is a trap base for sure. Okay, unlucky. I'd love to get the 28k sulfur by tonight. And for that, I definitely need a jackhammer and a mini. But again, I think I can make that work. I don't think that'll be a big problem. Guys, I was on small and cargo came out. And and I actually should be the first person here. You know what? I'll even say this. If I'm not the first person here, I'll turn around. Eh. Okay, yeah, I'll turn around. Be responsible, rust the loot, caretaker. We got to be the first people on here. There's no chance. As soon as it got announced, it, I went straight to it. So we're definitely the first people here, which is a scrumptious dub. I just need to, uh, I just need to win. Make sure that I win. No losing. None of that. None of that. Got to be careful about boats and minis. Definitely that guy in the mini, dude.
that one song that's like determination, power, and will, or whatever? That's like me. Spoon's out here snoozing. Bro's relaxing, having a good night of sleep. I took a, such a fat L on wipe day. Not... As much as I want to go loot it, I don't think it's worth the risk. I took such a fat L on wipe day that I'm up at like 3 a.m. offline farming and I broke a keyboard. Like, and, and I should add, I've never broken a pref reel before. Not once. Ever. In my life. I don't think I have. You know, a few desk slams here and there. It happens. I think someone just got on. Are you kidding me? You've got to be joking me right now, dude. Ah, uh, this is not what we need. And I'm out of meds, dude. This is like the worst situation you could be in. Got him to 29 health, which is not too bad. Could be worse. I kind of choked a little bit. I'm not going to lie. I, I thought the boat I heard was the boat from the guy I killed. So I didn't really think much of it, but this puts me in a bad spot. With little meds and not even full health against a guy that's like perma crouching is very difficult. Not a place you want to be in. I'm assuming he did one of two things. He's going to the top or he took my boat. If he takes my boat, painful, but I'll be okay with it. This guy is ratting. I respect it. Okay. Phew. That was intense. More intense than it needed to be. But thank God we won that, dude. Oh, and we got a nice good health gun, which is nice. Now, you know what? I'm just going to sit up here and keep an eye out for other boats so that we don't let that happen again. Because my God, that was too close for comfort for me. And uh, my MP5 is like busted pretty badly. But this P2 will do. We'll be good against anyone that comes. As, as long as I'm chilling up here, we'll be okay, I think. Unless they come from the front, but I still think we'll be okay. It's the nice thing about playing solo servers or even just group cap servers, but this server in specific, I kill this guy, I know there's no one left. You know what I mean? It's kind of nice, I will say. The good part about these like group cap servers is once you kill the, the max amount of people, you're good. There's something to these servers that makes them more stressful than regular rust for me. It's weird. It's like backwards. For a lot of people, they play against these groups and they get like nervous or whatever. I don't get that. But when I'm playing like solo duo trio servers or something, like it, it's like opposite. I'm more stressed doing that. It's kind of funny. Nice little bolt from the elite crate. 47 seconds on this first crate. Come on, boys. Hook it up. Hook it up, cargo. Things are looking good right now. I don't want to jinx it. I very well could be, but things are looking up really good. I'm getting countered. Oh, no. Go away. Go away. Go away. I think we're good. He was trying to swim and messed up, I guess. Yeah, we're okay. But I'm telling you, every time I go underneath, countered. It's so weird. It's so weird telling you every time i go underneath cargo i get countered it's like it's just messed up all right let's see uh this first credit in i face mask mp5 laser eh some comps regular stuff we'll take it all right 10 seconds give us an ak or seven one ak all right cool cool we're stacking them up Stacking them up like cheesecakes, you feel me? It's pretty good stuff, I must say. Now we just have that last crate to deal with, and uh, I think we'll be all good. If we get, like, one more AK out of this, or some boom of some kind, like Rocket C4, especially Rocket, I'll be stoked. That'll be quite possibly the best outcome I think we could ask for here. In the meantime, I'm going back down underneath, so, you know, can't wait to get countered again. I've opened up a lot of green crates today. I'm surprised I haven't found an airdrop yet in one. I've probably opened up like at least 50, I want to say, and somehow still have nothing to show for it. Well, that's not true. We're working there. We're working there. It's it, Things are going good. I can't even hate. We're killing it right now. Ooh, rocket launcher. Okay. Elite crate. 
Oh, oil refinery. That's killer, actually. I really needed one of those. Like, bad. That's hype. Let's go, dude. I needed that badly. Dude, if we get this back to base, this is a killer run, which uh, I think we can. It looks like this last crate's gonna end right about as we get to base, actually, so that's good. This is an insane comps haul, though. We might even be able to get back to Smoil, and assuming there's no one on it, get the crate. Because that's where I came from. I was I was just doing some spoil, like I said. I was farming, and I saw cargo spawn, so I instantly went. Figured three crates is better than one. Well, it looks like that's the case so far. But that does mean that this crate's unlocked, which means we could potentially get a fourth crate, which is nice. It is very late at night now on Thursday. Gotta make up for my pathetic display of wipe day prowess today. So I'm putting in those extra hours, which is, uh, it is what it is, you know? It happens. It happens to the best of us. Not everyone could have a good wipe day. Let's see if anyone's been able to get too small. I don't see any scientists, but I don't know. I feel like they should have respawned by now unless someone went and grubbed it. But I might be confused. I don't know if it's really worth the risk. I'm going to be honest. Maybe what I'll do is I'll get off a of cargo and come back here. I think that's what I'll do instead. I, that, that feels like a safer and a better bet. I don't really feel like risking all my stuff. Not all of it, but this... I have a beautiful chunk of stuff in this uh, boat back here. I don't think it's really worth risking it for one cargo crate or uh, one oil crate. This is like 2,000 scrap worth of components plus the guns and this is a lot of stuff. It's not really worth it to uh, potentially throw it all away. Come on, give me something good. At least another AK. Come on. Oh, yeah. Okay. We'll take it. Disappointing, but we'll take it. These comps are insane. I got to be careful that I'm getting camped, though. This guy, uh, it's like Cy Cypher. This guy does not like me. We are beefing hard for some reason. I feel like he's going to try and raid me. I'm going to upgrade like insane momentarily here so he can have a good time with that looks like my doors are still on it's always a good sign it's an expensive door i mean this is an expensive raid for day one your cheapest bet would be like a stone wall and two armor doors plus a garage door i mean you're looking at like nearly 20 rockets already Woo! amazing come up i definitely could have pulled our way way more loot I finally feel like I'm catching up to Spoon a little bit. feel like I'm uh, beginning to beginning to get to a point where I can start to farm for sulfur. I have a lot of kits now. I have ammo, meds, cards. I need about 30,000 sulfur, which is about 100 sulfur nodes, which is really not that bad. Am I just like coping myself into that? Or I very well could be, but 100 sulfur nodes is not the worst. I suppose. Certainly is not the best. I will admit that. But basically, I've fallen behind by like 12 hours with Spoon. Like, he's had a 12 hour head start on me uh, because I suck at this game. So let's head back to Smoil, I suppose. Crate's still there. And uh, see if we could get our fourth crate. That would be hype. So here's my to do list of things that I want to do tonight that. I can't do all in one night. One, I want to get a compound going. I want to get a turret set up, which requires electricity, and I need to get a windmill. I want to get a mini and a jackhammer, and I want to get 30,000 sulfur as well. That's quite a lot to do for one person in one night, um, if we're being completely and entirely honest here. I think out of that, we just have to determine what is the most important. I'm pretty confident. Oh, and I want to upgrade this base too. But I am pretty confident that we're not going to get raided. I feel pretty safe in saying that. I mean, on wipe day, it's a pretty hefty raid. I think if we upgrade the base a little bit, like we could get the best of both worlds. Upgrade the base just a tad and then farm for like an hour and I think we'll be good. A hundred sulfur nodes in an hour is reasonable. With the mini, for sure. Crates are here, that's a good sign. I'm gonna assume there's no one on. That or someone already just emptied the crate or didn't empty the crate rather and is like griefing it, but that's fine. Cargo was, was worth it, I think. I don't think it's looted. Eh. Explosive. That's good. It's one step closer. Just need rocket now. Good health bolts. Nice too. 
worth the trek back, but I think our time oiling for the night has come to an end. We're just gonna work on the base upgrades now and uh, call it a night. Come back tomorrow feeling maybe refreshed a little bit <laughs> in like a couple hours and uh, get back to it. Of course, oh, there we go. There's the airdrop I was talking about, jeez. Uh, of course, as the time goes on, I will update you guys if anything important happens. It's an interesting way to play Rust, I've got to say. This is like the most competitive aspects of Rust I've ever played, I guess, if that makes sense. It's pretty fun in like a funny, weird way. It's I, I really enjoy it, actually. It's, it's fun like doing a wipe against your friend. I don't think I've ever seen anyone do that before. All right, I've done some farming and things have actually been going by a bit quicker than I expected. Let me give you a quick base tour really fast before it turns night. We have these things metaled up. We've built all the way up, a little bit of a sneak peek. We have a shooting floor, which I'm gonna put windows on momentarily. We have a windmill, beautiful, coming in from the outside. Check this out. We have a turret, good stuff. We got the base built up pretty hefty. I'm not gonna lie, it's, it's actually looking good. Now, the only goal I have left is to get a compound and to get that sulfur. And uh, we're making pretty decent time. Oh, and I'm crafting a tier three workbench, if you didn't notice. We are cooking, ladies and gentlemen, we're doing good. We're doing great, actually. We're killing it right now. This is just what the doctor ordered. Yup, I said it. Guys, guys, it is getting progressively later, but look what I've done. I've done it. This should be enough sulfur to raid Spoon Kid's base. Ah. <sighs> You know what, man? I might have had a bad wipe. I might be a bad wipe player, but you can't outgrind the grinder. We got to get this cooked up somehow. It's going to be a lot of cooking and more importantly, a lot of charcoal. But once we get that, we're going to be good to go. We're going to have the green light. I'm just going to walk over there and just blow his base to smithereens yo all right i swear it's gonna be a good time it'll be a fun online hopefully i don't fumble this one but i am exhausted i'm gonna see if i could set up some piping i did research the stuff but i have no idea how it works no clue but i'm gonna try it and uh go from there boys this is it this is the last stretch all I gotta do is pray that I don't get offline raided, and we'll be good. Before I go to bed for the night, I'd like to show you what I made. So, I made this off of memory. I don't know why they make the piping so hard, and the electricity so hard. It's so hard to understand how to pipe things up, and how to electrify things. Like, they need to make this easier, honestly. I just feel like it's too complicated. But I made it so that it automatically cooks all my sulfur. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I could just leave this running and go to bed, I think. I have the sulfur cooking in the furnaces for the charcoal. I have some metal in the large furnace outside. I'll give you guys a little day one loot tour, or a brief one anyways. We have enough pipes to raid tomorrow for sure. Raid supplies, guns, not too bad. Armor, not too bad. Ammo, junk, cards, not too bad. Some sulfur, plus uh, plus all this that it still needs to smelt. So it'll be smelting for probably an hour or two, but I need to get some rest. I'm losing my voice. Good night. Oh, the low grade. Good night for now. I'll see you guys when I wake up. We'll be raiding Spoon Kid tomorrow. Let's go. Or later today. Oh, God. I gotta go to bed. Hello? Hey. Hello. How's it going, buddy? Pretty good. How are you? I'm great. Are you ready? I am ready to fuck you with it. Sorry. <clears throat> Actually, did you farm? Yeah, bitch. Okay. I'm hyped, man. I got two lines of silver. Uh, okay. Nice. Thank you. Guys, I have more than two lines of silver. I think that'll be enough sulfur to uh, blow him up. That'll be good. Ooh, I grinded all night for this, and I slept for like three hours. You need to like cook it up for you or something? No, no, I don't think so. Okay. It's pretty cooked, it's pretty cooked, pretty good. Medium rare. Nice, nice. nice. I'm ready to 
Fucking blow you out of the fucking server, dude. Ah, <sighs> okay. Good luck, man. Thanks. I have a, I have a mini now, so you know, kind of bossing up a little bit. Wow, you're so special. Uh, -huh. I noticed you had a bolty turret. That's cool. Yeah, that, trying to, that. Trying to go to the fishing village got bolted. Good, <laughs> good. That dude. was awesome, dude. Uh, did you empty my large furnace or what? No, I didn't even. I, I didn't even try. All right, good. It was literally full of sulfur. Are you kidding me? Dude, I set up this intricate piping in this base. It's actually really complicated for no reason. Uh, that's cool. What are you scheming, bro? Nothing. Something? You Nothing. Scheming something? Nothing. I'm not a schemer, dude. You are, bro. I hear you right now. Listen what to yourself. You Nothing. I'm not scheming, dude. I would never scheme. I don't yeah. like scheming. I don't... Yeah. I don't scheme. I'm just working on walling and sulfur quarry, that's all. Why would you even bother? Because I'm going to defend your raid and then take over the server. Whatever you say, big Two man. Two lines of sulfur, dude. 12k? Are you kidding? That's all I could get last night. You know that's eight rockets, right? What the fuck are you gonna do with eight rockets? Go deep on a door and then... I have nine armored doors. I was gonna upgrade it, but I was like, ah, I gotta give him a fighting chance. Another blazed hand out, you know? Okay, dude. This guy. And what happens when I blow your as shit up? Uh, I rebuild? No. No, you don't. I rebuild and destroy you? This guy up the hill is, like, bossing up. I bossed TF up, bro. You did, boss. I was impressed. When I got on, I was expecting you to see, like, a 2x2, two two, and nah, you just I... gave up. I was impressed. Was like, he, he fucking, he put in the work. I had to I put in the work. That. You had the good wipe day. I had to put in the work. How late were you on? Till like, 7. You messaged me at, like, 7.30. I went to bed literally, like, two minutes before that. At, okay. like, 29. The boarding. I'm out here sacrificing my health for this rust wipe. Keep getting texts, of, like, from random numbers trying to sell me weed. He goes, hey, yo, white boy, you need me to pick you up a cart today? What? What the, what the fuck? <laughs> Who is this, dude? I don't even know if this is a scam. I think someone just like gave, like, old... a dealer the wrong number. <laughs> is it, like, someone old from school or some shit? No, I don't think so. I'm not even hey, yo, white weed boy, from you random people. Pick me up a cart. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, man. Well, he's out here hustling, dude. Guys, I'm going to start my day off right. I'm going to ladder up on top of his roof and steal his mini. <laughs> I'm starting the day off proper. Feel me? I don't think he's got turrets on his base. Let's, uh, let's craft some of these bad boys. Go over with an AK for the boys. Why not? Let's just uh, let's go head over there. Take what's rightfully mine. Get that thing. Look at him leave. So beautiful. That is unlucky timing, I've got to say. <sighs> All right, I'm a little nervous, but I think this will go good. I think now we just wait here. We wait for him to come back. Can I block this in? I can. <laughs> yes. In interest of not being a scumbag, I'm going to try not to kill him coming back. He's at Sulphur Quarry. I feel like that would be lame. But I do want to jack his mini, so... He knows something's up. You are such a <laughs> bitch, dude. I knew it. I said I didn't want to uh, kill you, but how do you know what was up? <laughs> how do you know? I saw the ladders, uh, bro. Well, I'm gonna take my free ride. Are home. you for real right now? I'm Are a, you for real, I'm bro? A legit kid. I, I, I was trying Are not to kill real, you. Are you for real, bro? Hey, look at me. Get look out at of me. here. Look at me. Hey, hey, I'll hey. kill you, man. Hey, Fuck. Later, buddy. That's crazy, dude. No, I was trying to be. I was trying to be all fair and shit. Yeah, whatever, uh, dude. Yo, whatever. I was. <laughs> I, I cannot believe best. that. How could you do that to me? Free minicopter. Dude, I was I was working God all night it. last night towards one of these. I fucking hate you, dude. I, I log on and you're bragging about this helicopter. And, and I mean, <laughs> I just... Come on, dude. I have seven diesel. What would you trade for that? For real? Yes, I do. I'll give you something for that. All right. What about another mini? Really, bro? Hey, get away. Get away. Are you fucking for real? 
What are you gonna give me? What are you gonna give me? Seven diesel, sir. Give me the seven diesel right now. Give it to me. Why are you on my roof? Hello? Hello? Get on my roof! Sorry. <clears throat> Come on, man. You broke my build up too. And you brought grenades. This guy, I didn't bring grenades. I didn't stoop that low. Yeah, whatever, dude. That's my mini. Um, then why is it on my- You were trying to push it off? <laughs> you son of a bitch, dude. You are such no. a fucking piece of shit. No, Look I at wasn't. You. Look at if I can't have it, no one can. Because you- I know, I know why you did that. Because you didn't bring low grade. Because you forgot. No, yeah, no. It's because you forgot low why. grade. That's I know the, that's why. That's not why. Look at you, dude. You should be ashamed of yourself. Can I just have it back, please? Let me use the mini for one hour. One hour and then what? And then I give it back and you get it for an hour. It's like a child. So what, do you got dual custody on the mini? <laughs> yes. I don't want that deal. I don't like that deal. It's my mini. That's the fairest deal I've ever seen. It's my mini though. I should have taken your full metal gear set too. God damn yeah, it. Whatever, Why didn't dude. I do that? Look at you. I had laddering up my shit. I feel all violated now. My base is stellar though. You would it is a nice base. I'll give you that. Yeah. Look at you, you fucking punk ass bitch. Oh my god, I fell to death. Look at you, you're so cute. Hi. That's a good try. Fuck you, fuck you, man. Come on. Look at you down there trying to get the grub on me. With your I just want my mini. Oh, you just brought low grade back. this time. I good job, dude. Back. You remembered the low grade. All right, I'm giving up. No more. I'll give you the mini back. Let me run some oils. Uh, no, I don't want it. I don't want it. Oh, you don't want it. We're not friends anymore. <laughs> All right, here's what I need. I need a rocket. A BP. All right, give me 2K sulfur. I'll give you a rocket. <sighs> okay, reasonable trade. All right, beloved, let's get out of here. Smells like fuck foot cheese over here. Hey, you hear that guy doesn't have a mini? I think he's poor. You're the worst. <laughs> this is so upsetting. Oh my god, dude. Oh, 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 oh. Look at that. Look at that mini. It's all mine. <laughs> he left the call. <laughs> I'm sorry. In the meantime, let's go run oil. Get some scrap. Raid this guy. I look forward to this. This will be nice. Is he AFK? What is that laser? Did he die or something? Why is there a laser over there too? If these are heavies, I think he died. I see now. Okay. What the hell? Hello? Hey. Where are you at? Uh, I just destroyed uh, your base and killed both of your horses. Are you serious? <laughs> Goodbye, beloved. No, that's fucked up. What'd you do? You have any words? Did you raid me? That's Come fucked up see. if you raided me. The moment see. Oh my god. Hold on, I can't hear anything. Hold on. Oh my god. What'd you do? What did you do? What'd you do to my fucking base, motherfucker? This is not a joke. What'd you do? Did you raid me? Goodbye. You Goodbye, did not raid Mr. me. Mr. Horse. <laughs> I did wow. something worse. This guy goes from getting his horse killed and, and f causing up a fuss about it to killing uh -huh. horses now. Yeah. You've changed, dude. What are you going to do about it? You've changed. I'm sorry. I'm pulling out all the stops, man. Did Camp you in fucking my roof? actually raid me? Bro, where are you? Go take a look at what I did. I'm getting a heli for you, you bastard oh, bitch. Oh, yeah, sure you I are. I am. Hey, nah, sure go you on are, your dude. phone on Rust Plus. Look at the cams on oil. Guess who's fucking up oil right now? single-handedly oh, oh, oh yeah your boy yeah. blaze oh, rust whatever. yep and there's two minis here including mine yours ours hold on what'd you do to my base <laughs> god damn listen, it listen man you fuck with the bull you get the horns you fuck with the bull you get the horns piece of shit you i what did you do i'm literally out here fragging on oil right now stressed out beyond belief my horses are dead my lovely lovely horses if you're ending it like this that's fuck can you hear up. that i'm gonna farm all night oh my <laughs> no, god i'm not i'm not raiding you man i would never you are definitely raiding me right now 
I'm not. That's scheming, Kevin. I'm scheming. God damn it, I'm busy. You want me to share my screen? Yeah, I guess. Dude. Dude, really? You are such a fucking piece of shit. What? Stop that! You're sodomizing my horse! <laughs> my beloved! You know what? And I, I, this is I what was I do bluffing, to your beloved, too. Dude. dude, my beloved was actually the one in the whore in the thing! Not the one outside. Dude, that's fucked up, man. That is really depressing. <laughs> And there's a rib here, god damn it. Let me catch a break. Hey, Mr. Bear, you want to eat his beloved? Stop! Mmm, yummy. All right, back to work. Man, fuck you. Back to work, my asshole. You're a piece of shit. Yeah? I hate you. Oh my god, how do you even get a horse in this game? I just found it, and I was so hyped. I'm literally <laughs> raging on oil. I'm going John Wisdom mode, fucking shooting everybody, and I'm pissed off. And it's Eric uh -huh. Cartman again, you grub piece of shit. Oh my god, my day is ruined. My disappointment's immeasurable. Well, that was the call. <laughs> I'm getting countered again. The horse was actually god mode. That is mm -hmm. the cheat code to solo rust is the yes, fucking it is. horse. And you took that away from B. Yep. And I died I died to a fucking rat. Wow. So now I don't have a mini. Maybe you can horse back to the fishing village. Oh. Oh. I forgot. This is <laughs> is <laughs> is is rage Ooh. inducing. I swear you're going to hell. Pinto deserved it. Okay. Don't say that. Pinto Don't bring him into this. Deserved it. He has nothing to do Pinto with this. Pinto deserved it. Come on, dude. Better put on those running shoes, man. All that to just to get ratted on oil. Even more tragic. Quite Let possibly. Just borrow your mini for an hour. I yeah, was dude. just gonna borrow Good your mini word. for an hour. Yeah, five minutes, it's gone. Well, the it wouldn't. No, experience. no, it wouldn't have been gone because you were stressing me the fuck out, and I was oh, like, I gotta get yeah, out of here. I was and stressing leave. you out. And and then I left in a haste and didn't check my surroundings because I thought I was getting raided because this guy is sitting in my base going. <laughs> sodomizing my poor fucking dead horse and and it, 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 i mean it's fucked up out here really you don't find yourself fucked up in the head sometimes holy shit i can't wait to have a word with you <gasps> ah! Ah! beloved my beloved i only had to run two squares <laughs> you found another one yes i did what the fuck you better put an Baby. armored fucking door on that thing uh, dude i'm coming for him oh uh, hey buddy hey you pumpkins buddy oh look at you He's so cute. Kevin, you should try to get a horse sometime. Dude, I need to get a bunch of turrets up. You could just research the one outside. Yeah, but then I don't have one, and then you're going to fucking rat me all day because you're a rat. Oh, a wait. Blood. I broke it. Oh, fuck. I forgot. <laughs> no turrets for wow, please. you just ruined my day in one foul swoop. Why do you have to break it? That's toxic. Well, my beloved has his armored palace now. Oh, some piece oh, of shit neighbor. naked. What, dude? Neighbor. What? Hey, no, I naked. I naked. <sighs> What's up, buddy? I'm having a rough day. Hey, there's this guy that lives fucking uh, V14. Can you offline raid him? He's actually so toxic. I swear. He's like a horse sodomizer. I'm telling you. I'm not kidding when I say that. I yeah, that means you have anal sex with the horse. He killed my horses <laughs> and then had anal sex with the horse. Yeah, I know. Isn't that just... Don't people die from that yeah no people die from getting fucked by the horse oh okay 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. he was fucking the horse but but he's got such a small penis that it, it didn't do anything really i mean you know god bless rest his soul but god damn it dude i really miss my horse bro you had a horse out here this morning i know and he killed it Damn right, and you didn't kill it because you're a normal person. Holy shit, and that guy killed it. What a piece of shit. I'm serious. You got to door camp that guy for hours. I will give you real money, PayPal, crypto, Venmo, fucking anything. I need you to do I'll pay you 20 bucks an hour to just sit outside his door. What I was going to say was is that I'm your, I'm your neighbor, and I was just wondering if you might not offline me. I won't offline you. You can tell, obviously, my, my vendetta is, is elsewhere, you know, like, I, I, I got nothing against you, brother. You know what I'm saying? You're the guy that lives in the river. I won't raid you. No, 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 no. I live in the, you probably ain't even seen my base. I live in the rocks. Oh, like shit. 310. Yeah, well, I won't raid you, but that guy at V14 probably will because he's a bitch. He's taking my heli. He's taking my heli. 
This guy is so shameless. I'm serious. It's unbelievable. <laughs> Why, Heli? Oh my fucking god. Are you fucking for real? Yeah, what's up, big hoss? You, you, got, a, you, got, you got a mini? I don't have a mini because he's, he's a piece of shit. Oh my god, don't even let me get started with this whole mini thing. All right, hold on. I got to go control my heli and go fuck this guy. Thank you. My beloved. Fuck you! I'm not buying it! What the fuck? <laughs> let me keep my gear set. Um, I let you keep yours. I think maybe not. You mean the hazmat? What's the gear set? My bolt. Yeah, we'll see about that. Right, well, how about you give it another go, man? I'm good, thanks. Are you giving up? Yeah. No, you're not. Yeah. You are not giving up, Haley, dude. I'm giving up. I don't want it. What are you scheming? I'm going back to oil, you piece of shit. No, you're scheming something. What are you doing? Whatever you say. Don't you scheme on me. What'd you get? Hold on. Dude, why are you trying so hard? Because you're coming back somewhere. I know. I'm not. I know you are, dude. I'm literally in the water going to large. You are crazy, fucking bro. Hacker. Fucking you are hacker. Crazy, Yo, pick me up. Pick, this guy's hacking, you, Cypher. Crazy. This guy's a fucking hacker. That's this guy's crazy, hacking. Dude. This guy's you hacking. Door camping. No. What'd, you, what'd you get on the heli? <laughs> you fucking suck. Tell me. Stop! 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 Don't do that. Dude! What'd you get? What? What'd you get? I guess you'll never know. Because it was shit. If you got an M2, you would have shot me with the M2. If you got rockets, I would have seen them on your hip. You hear that? No. Yeah, I got an M2. God damn it. The rich get richer. Holy shit. We got to the eat them. The door camp is crazy. How is that crazy? That was a 200 IQ strategy. You thought I wouldn't think about that, really? Yeah. You would have had a better special. shot trying to counter the door I camping. I disagree. Because you're Sitting fucking in a shrouded. Can I get my bolt back? A 7 diesel for a bolt. All and, right, I'll do With that. my 4X laser. Mm. Yes, yes, yes. Fuck you, yes. Fair deal. And you killed my horse again. Oh my. Where are you at? I'm about to be here. If I die, you better run out and fucking save my shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my it's god. Me, it's oh me. my god. Oh. It's get me. Fucked. What are you doing? It's me. Oh. Scammer gets scammed. Scammer gets scammed. Scammer gets scammed. Are you serious? I'm kidding. Get get off your roof. Get off your roof. I'm joking. It's I'm putting it on your body. Where are you? Stop! Ow! <laughs> <laughs> Pick me up. Hey! Uh, you know what? Actually, I did you a service because that python and a whole kit was stashed behind this rock over here. Right here, where this python is. Once again, give me my shit back. Right. <laughs> Blazed! I Fuck gave you, you your bowl. Fuck you stopped you. that. You killed my horse three oh, times. No. There's a naked coming up. Oh, oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Is he looting you? Oh fuck. Yeah. Enemy down. Get inside, bro. I'm trying. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. you. Fuck you. Be. Fuck you. Give me my you. diesel. No, you don't get shit. Oh, he... Give me my ammo. Yeah. Give me my ammo. That's mine. That's all mine. I killed the guy for it, actually. And Arctic suit. And Arctic suit. He was door camping you too, and I yeah, killed him. Yeah. All right. Him. Whatever. God, you're so lucky. You have good, such good friends. What? Uh, can you tell me what you got out of the heli? Just because I'm curious. Because I, I actually worked for that thing a little bit. Poop rocket, M2, rifle ammo, custom. Eesh. Yeah, you could you could take that. Yeah, pretty mid heli. <laughs> Killed my horse again. All right, that was uncalled for. I don't know why I did Th that. This guy goes. This guy goes. Raid me, raid me right now. And then wonders why it takes seven years to raid him because I got to run across this shit map. Use your fucking brain, moron. Sorry. Can we make a pact? No more killing horses, you piece of shit. All right, no more horse killing. I shouldn't even tell you. I'm gonna tell you this. I'm gonna tell you this because I I miss her, him, it. 
I got a box of sulfur in like 30 minutes last night. I, I mean, it was like bonkers. With the beloved. With the beloved. And I have it all cooked up waiting. I just need this fucking shit. But when I raid, I don't think I'm going to tell you because you're going to HV me like, like a little cuck. I won't HV you. No PvP rocketing. No PvP rocketing. God damn, I'm gonna lose. How the fuck am I supposed to recover if I lose an online raid against this guy? Well, you know, I just gotta ego check dude. you, man. I don't know why I think you're so much better than me at this game. Because I am, Kevin. You're little bro, dude. What do you mean I'm? You used to bro. stream snipe me. Now you stream snipe me. Motherfucker, no, fuck no. Yeah. Yeah, good luck, dude. I did used to stream snipe you. I'm a proud Spoon Kid, guys. If you two stream snipe Spoon Kid, you'll end up like me. Oh my god. Dude, this right. fucking piping shit is so complicated. Look at this. The share screen. What do you get? Look at this fucking loser ass base piece of shit. Sorry. They, you might want to show show you're recording this. Stop! 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 God. <laughs> so, you have this pipe. Ugh. Like, I don't even know what's going on. I got like three splitters and two branches. I don't know how to do that. Do you have to look that. up a tutorial? No, I just have no idea what I'm doing. And then... This piping, they make so complicated for no oh reason. Oh my god, dude, what are you doing? They, for no reason, it's so complicated. Why can't you have it hug a wall? Because it's so complicated. I can't follow anything. I don't know what's going dude, on. Dude, what the fuck is this? It just gets this? worse and worse until you get into here and you get... Oh, you said you had two rows. I know, I was lying. Holy shit, yep. I'm done for. You are done for on a foundation wipe your ass. Okay, all uh, right, I'm ready, dude. Let's fucking do it. Damn, this is gonna be epic. It's gonna be le epic. So you have the upper hand here, cause I don't know how to defend raids. I usually just call Llama on to help. Bro, I call Llama on to help me raid. Like, <laughs> what? Yeah, that's true. But like, I don't even know. Like, I, I just like sit in a corner. Like, I don't know what. <laughs> I mean, like, I don't know what I'm doing. I do too. When, when we're raiding with Llama, I just sit there. Like, Llama, tell me where to shoot. Shoot where I need to shoot. He just right. shoots. I just rocket. Crafting. Oh shit. Crafting. Crafting. I gotta make this happen, man. I gotta go to the gym in an hour. I'm gonna slam you in the raid and then go bench 225. Can I come with you? Yeah. If you slam me in the raid, I'm gonna drop the bench on your head. So watch out. I'm not gonna spot you. I wouldn't I'm have you spot me anyways. You can't I'm... lift that weight. Okay, dude. Really? So it's looking like I'm gonna bring 20 rockets to the to your fucking address. <laughs> I had to pull this armored door off of my base. How do you do the C4 with the thing? Can you like turn off the C4? I think so, yeah. Here, let's test it. Enable RF, set frequency. I'm gonna set it to 810, 8010. I'm just gonna go chuck it on your house. See what happens. Hello, Mr. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, watch this, watch this. I'm gonna make him think he's getting. I wanna see what he says. Look at it. He just ran around. I'm pretending. Oh my god, he's killing me! Oh my god! He almost just killed me. That was launcher outside, Mr. Crystal. That was launcher outside. <laughs> <laughs> he, almost... he almost died of this. <laughs> no, he can't be. He can't be in fucking 10 health. What the fuck is Mr. Pretzel mean? Uh, who's Mr. Pretzel? <laughs> yeah, what is he talking about? <laughs> Is he say, I think he's speaking in coded language. Oh, gee whiz. I hope he's not door camping my shit. Got him. Dude, I can't believe this guy almost just clipped me that hard. I, I mean, truthfully, like 10 health. <laughs> like, That's awesome. That would have been the greatest play in Russ history, and I would have been all for it. Dude, he's back outside, by the way. What'd he say? What's he saying? Mr. He's saying Mr. Pretzel. I don't know what the fuck. <laughs> hey, man. I appreciate it. Uh, Blaze is going to try and raid me, though. So, yeah. No, you're good. Thanks, but Thanks for the heads up, though. Dude, I almost got Yeah, cool. you can watch it. For sure. Says that. he's gonna commentate the raid. <laughs> <laughs> all right, the raid is commencing. I have built a stage base. I've moved all the boom in there, as you guys saw, and uh, it's beginning. I'm gonna try and really, uh, you know, try and really win this one. I mean, I think I got some good tricks up my sleeve. I'm a little worried that he's gonna push out of his front door, though. That is what I'm worried most about: is him pushing out and getting on the ground. All right, hold on. Let's test this Johnson out real quick. Set eighty ten. Mr. Pretzel said I could watch. Okay, just yeah, stay. You watch. yeah, you can watch. Just stay back a little bit. I know. I'm just staying on this road. Oh, fuck. Wait, what? 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 No. No. I think you did it right. I, don't, I didn't do it right. Huh? Oh? Uh. They stopped beeping. 
You're gonna shoot me, and this kid is just gonna loot and leave. Well, like, what do I do? Like, did I just kill you? Like, how does this work? I mean, we're going. I, you know what okay. I'm saying? Like, so I should try and kill you from the roof? Like, is that allowed? Like, yeah. I mean, do your raid. All right, like, All right I'm gonna raid like, defense. No, no H, no, no rocket, rocket PVP, PVP. But I'm gonna defend. I'm gonna try not to rocket PVP you. Um, you can rocket PVP me. I think that's fair. I'm gonna try not to though. All right. But if things get grim looking, all right. On your mark, whenever you're ready. Oh, yeah, I'm ready, man. Go for it. My, that just bugged out my sound. Fucking roof campers, dude. Yeah, that didn't work out for you. He's <laughs> just commentating. <laughs> get, them, get the raid commentator. He's calling me Mr. Goldfish. Dude, with the pro angles. Wow. Wow. Did you just kill the kid? I don't, I spawned in the wrong bag. Gotcha. Tricked ya. Oh. Saved. Wow, you beamed me with that M2. I didn't think you were holding that. Oh my god. Shrimp! Shrimp! <laughs> shrimp is on the keyboard, man. <laughs> Good girl, Shrimp. Hey, you're getting raided. You should defend. I'm trying, dude. I got a fucking cat on my keyboard. Is that you? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> it's got a raid commentator, dude. Have a kid on, he said. <laughs> He's talking shit. Have a kid on. Come on, I'm trying, <laughs> dude. The fuck? Dude, He's this is bad. But there's another guy here. Is that you? No. Oh my god, I just died. Are you dead? I'm dead. No. No. Oh my god, I thought that was you. Where is he? Shh. No, no. Oh, no, stop! No, turn around! No, I was giving it to you. I thought you were in there. Is he the one leaving? Yes, yes, yes. Where's... All right, he's dead. Okay, we're good. Go get the go. Go get the shit. Jesus Christ, dude! <laughs> oh I my just god! Save your fucking raid, dude. <laughs> yeah. This kid is like running straight at him with the fucking with the AK kit. He's like, yeah, yeah. Here, take this, Mr. Goldfish. He's running straight at the guy that just killed me. Mr. Oh. Goldfish. <laughs> I'm like, no, no! Okay, we're good. Back in business? Back in business. <gasps> oh. You're going down with the ship. Are you on timer yet? Oh, fuck. You opened it? Damn right oh, I did. Oh, shit. I love this kid, man. This is awesome. There goes your bed. I'm I'm coming for you. Oh! More shots There's some guy in my raid base. It's fucking Cypher. Are you dead? No, I'm good. I don't know where you are, though. Wow! I, dude, I honestly think you're hacking. I'm not joking. There is sweat underneath my armpits right now. That's insane, that fucking pe No, you didn't. No, you didn't! <laughs> no! You didn't. You better start rebuilding quick, buddy. Dude, <laughs> quit it with that fucking peek! Dude, don't seal.
Is that you? <laughs> Look at you. No, I just killed some other guy. Huh? Oh my god. Chill. Oh, oh, I had no meds in like seven health. How do we determine when I win? Oh my god! I got a yoke. I got a yoke. <laughs> it's Eric Cartman. No way. No way. <laughs> I am deadly serious. And he got away. Where's the gun box? Eric Cartman got away. Oh my god, he killed me. It's over. Hey, no, I killed you. Eric got away. Oh, Eric, oh my Eric god. Eric fucking bounced, dude. <laughs> How many rockets did he get? Like two. I yeah. have done. All right. I don't know. What, what do we call that? I'd call that I won. Hey, it's me. What? Okay. I'd say I won. What do you think? Uh, I guess. Look at your base. I'm in your loot. Hey, let me out. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, you put another TC? Yeah. Ah, uh, shit. I think I won that one. You think? Yeah. I think I won. Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! Kill him? Okay. Uh, enemy, enemy, enemy! 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 Did he just kill you? No, I killed him. Ah. Uh, hey man, who won? I did for sure. I did for sure. I definitely won. He's so scared he won't even peek me. Yeah, I got TC. He's so scared he won't even peek me. Uh, there's a guy with the hatchet looting right there. <laughs> this just turned into like a fucking loot donation. Like, <laughs> even the beanie just came up and grabbed an L9. <laughs> I can't believe I got yoked by Eric Cartman. I can't believe that because really that is mad. humiliating, dude. <laughs> peek me. I won the raid, dude. Get out of here. I won. <laughs> No, Pick kill him. Pick That's, teaming. That's, Pick teaming. Pick That's teaming. 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 Ow! <laughs> Dumb and Dante's Inferno. <laughs> Jeez, I just got oven cooked like a Thanksgiving turkey, dude. I mean, look, I could I could have sealed if I... Well, where did you put the TC? In the front. Oh, my God, dude. We pretty much just so donated just my base to the naked. Good shit, boys. Wow. Wow, dude. Uh, wh what do you have to say about yourself? I think that there will be a rematch. All right, seal, seal the base, seal the base, run it back. Another time. You the all right, good idea. Mr. Goldfish? No, I don't have any more rockets. I got Eokid for all my rockets, but I won anyways. Oh, God. Wow. And guess who it is? God damn it. Eric fucking Cartman. I'd say that finishes off a well rounded wipe. I got my revenge on the horse killer himself, Spoon Kid. If you guys want to see us do something like this again, like up the video, drop a comment, maybe sub. You know what I'm saying? I'll see you guys on the next one. I hope you enjoyed. It's a very fun wipe. I actually like this. I think we could do something like this, like a format like this, tweak it a little bit and do it a little bit more frequently or not more frequently, but like, like better. You know what I'm saying? Do it again. All right, everybody. Have a good night. I'll see you on the next upload. Peace.